Fallen Empires. Usually they're a strong NPC that you only interact with in the late game, but today we are gonna start as the Fallen Empire. Here's how we're gonna do this. First we will create our Fallen Empire. I'm gonna be xenophile and fanatic pacifist to represent their declined state. Then we are gonna stop all other empires from spawning and instead increase primitive nations by 5 times. That way we will be the forerunner of every other galactic civilization. In addition, we will follow a set of rules. No expansion beyond 8 contiguous systems, about the same size as most fallen empires. We are not allowed to declare wars and we are not allowed to join the galactic community. But lastly, all of these rules will be annulled by the year 2400, the same year that fallen empires are allowed to awaken. Our goal is to build whatever alliance we can to stop a 1.5 Grand Admiral crisis. Some of you might think that's an easy challenge, but A, I'm not the best player, and B, there's a good chance that this will be just me fighting. No fallen empire, no other empires, nothing but my 8 system empire. Let's see how this goes. I've created what I consider a pretty good representation of a fallen empire. And we are up here in this now currently completely empty galaxy. I picked the Finnish inspired nameless because I felt that sounds very ancient. These guys live forever because they have venerable. They shall be the old granddads. They are the old ones. Not even one year in and we are apparently not the first one to the galactic stage, but uh, we are the only ones. All right, first tradition and it is definitely gonna be discovery because we have an entire empty galaxy. For the record, this is completely vanilla by the way, except for the tiny outliner. Wait, first contact with aliens? How? Oh, the curators. Okay, they still exist, of course. Very well. Bubbles. Another encounter. Oh, it's the Caravaneers. Oh god, if you ever think about doing this yourself, just get ready for a constant barrage of events. Anomaly discovered. System survey. Construction complete. Anomaly discovered. Technology research. Anomaly discovered. Anomaly discovered. Anomaly discovered. Anomaly discovered. Yes, yes, I get it. What you're looking at is the final size of my empire until 2400. Blue. Leader lifespan 10. <laughs> How long do they live? Ages under 200. They will live to see the awakening of this fallen empire. Carafor 3 is burning up. An advanced civilization of tiny squamate reptilians scurry about in frenzied activity. If this is the Prikikikiti, this will doom the entire project. I, I think this is the first time I've gotten this. I'm gonna let it stay that way oh yes even more leader lifespan <laughs> oh these will live forever wait there's the pretty t the lizards have broken free somehow they must have solved their time loop conundrum are you no 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 this is not happening this is not happening why are you kidding me fuck and I'm the only one that can stop him. Not allowed to declare war. Uh, 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 we need to stop the Pricky Kitty because they will destroy everyone. I know I put the rule that I'm not allowed to declare war, but this will literally doom the galaxy. We're gonna have to build a fleet. I haven't built a single ship. I don't have the alloys for it. I need to. I need my contacts right now. Whoa, got 2,000. <laughs> that was just pure luck. They're equivalent in tech, but they are inferior in fleet power. Nice. Is that a... Is that a relic? Wait, it's a ship? Oh, yes. Now we're coming for you, pretty T. Now we're going. I've built up as much as I can. It is literally just me and the pretty kitty. System surveyed. What? Die wait, as I said that. Oh the first one! Aside from those guys, the first one to have risen up. Alright. The uh, expeditionary force is on its way. 
They've traveled all this way. And now it's time to declare the war. What took you so long? That's literally what he said. I had to travel all this way. That's a fucking huge fleet. Oh shit, oh god. Quick, take out that station. Take out that station. Oh shit, they're coming on. Fuck. No. No. You cannot be. Wait, am I winning? <gasps> I fucking won that battle. Repair, everyone. Okay, go. Quick. Before they repair. The nanite interdictor is leading the way. I would have wished some more to join. No! Oh, fuck. I should have been more careful. No! I lost the nanite indictor. Um, we are fleeing. I took it all back. I'm gonna have to rebuild for 10 years and then come back. Oh, and it happened. They just declared war on the only other Galactic Empire. Oh, that was quick. I just want to emphasize the situation we're in. I am the guardian of this garden and I'm cultivating the civilizations here so they can grow. And that's just a big fuck off lawnmower ruining it all. This is the war in heaven. This is the war in heaven they're talking about. Oh, they're actually inferior now. It is time to go on the offensive again. All right, Expeditionary Force has once again arrived and this time we'll do it quickly. Yes, look at that. Now we're, we're gaining on them. They're getting swallowed by the might of the forerunners. Oh, Bubbles, <laughs> you've grown. Holy shit, look how big it is. Oh my God, it's fucking massive. Look, it's fucking huge. <laughs> <laughs> and we've done it! We have conquered the Pikiki T. We have saved the every civilization in the galaxy. But we're not gonna keep this territory. Instead, here's what we're gonna do. Create a sector, and then we are gonna release this sector. We shall call it the Pikiki Guardians. Now we have created a vassal, and now we shall give them every system we have and again and now we have given them all their systems back and now we're going to release them and there we now have another empire in this galaxy we have reformed the Prikikiti to be fanatic xenophile pacifist <sighs> and with that i can breathe a sigh of relief what? Oh my god, he immediately became xenophobic. I'm not mad, just disappointed. <laughs> there is no one to contact for the, the Prince event. Gained a Corvette. Called Greased Lightning. <laughs> okay, well, you know what? I think it's time for a little military expedition. I shall go on a big spree, killing all the hostile things. Oh, Guardians of Sanam. I have no idea what Sanam is. The Valley of Sanam. I don't think I've ever... Wait, what? Breeding grounds of a non-native species of hairless mammalians. Observed engaging in advanced courtship. Regrettably, the unintended sighting of our vessel spooked them. Amongst it, we have found a copy of the alien travel guide, a hitchhiker's guide to the galaxy. Was that what they were guarding? Like a 10k fleet guarding a breeding ground. <laughs> is that what the is that what the Valley of Sanam is? Oh, fighting the Edder Drake. Come on, there's so little left. Don't die on me now. God, we actually did lose it. If the beast has our scent, we should prepare for savage retaliation. Wait, hold on. It doesn't have our scent, right? Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. All right, so we have a Juggernaut. And Bubbles is so much bigger than it. <laughs> Okay, I've lost the dragon. <laughs> it's somewhere. Station threatened. What? Oh shit, it's here! Oh god, no! 
There we are. Nice. And guess what year it is? It is the year 2400. For 200 years we have kept ourselves here. Now I'm allowed to expand again. Whoa, there she is. What? Holy shit, look at that. Leader. That has to be the most insane I've ever seen. <gasps> Level 10 ruler. Look at that. Oh, fuck me. Here it comes. My level 10 Empress lived to see our first colony to the crisis. 162k. We can deal with that. We can deal with that. You and me, pricky. Against 400k. Let's move, 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 move. Oh no, it jumped in too quickly. It jumped in too quickly. Why does it always happen to me? Okay, how much did I lose that? A shit ton. It's 400k in each of them. I can't deal with that. I don't have the alloys. I can't. So oh no, they came in. 160k. Oh, the pricky. They're helping me. I don't know why, but I'll take it. Yeah, this is not going our way. They're coming with more. They're joining me with more. That means we might stand a chance. Okay, maybe we could make an incursion into them. Okay, we're actually punching through towards that. Oh, we can't eat that. We, I'm gambling now. Ship hull points 40, armor damage. Go! Is it maybe working? No, it's not working. It's not working. Fuck me, man. I made an effort. I actually tried. God, they were, uh, they were on my border now. Fuck. Oh my God, they're flooding in. This is all I have left. Lost. Mining station lost. I lost it all. No bubbles. No. No. They're just stack or wiping me. Oh god. Where is my juggernaut? There it oh god, it's engaging as well. And there it is. Do I even have any I have no shipyards left. Well it's safe to say that I've lost considering they're now bombarding my capital world. Reports from Celestial Throne informs us that a number of inhabitants have left. Yeah, I I wonder why. <laughs> Wait, they took it. They just took it. This is the last one. Fortitude. Uh oh. Shooting at it. Oh god. Oh, now they're, we're being bombed. Oh god, that is a lot of occupied worlds. They're opening fire. What is that sound? Whirlwind missiles. Oh. Jafon Secundus. It's the last one left out of all of this. Agnax is down to six pops. We had like 90. Wait, we st actually still live? Iva, you were the level 10 leader. You are now the last one of your kind living here in exile because you can't leave. Wait, we can leave. Experimental subspace navigation. All right. Jump to the Pricky Kitty. You'll be safe there. She left. It's all gone. We have a single world remaining with 12 pops that are actively being killed, one each month. Godspeed, my friends. So, on the question of uh, can I beat the crisis? No, I cannot. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this, I can recommend many more videos on my channel, mostly multiplayer with friends. You can probably find something that you like.